What's good? It's me, J King, aka Coach OG. Shout out to all my OGs, O A C O Head Gang. Shout out to my IQ ball, Ballers and the Clamp Camp. Excuse me, y'all. I mean, ice cream. I almost messed up the intro. All right, y'all. I got another replica bill for y'all. I ain't gonna lie to y'all, man. I'm gonna need y'all to like this one up, man. Just hit me in the comments. Hit the like. If you ain't subscribed, subscribe because this one was a challenge. Boy, I tell you, I was trying my best to get the best version of this possible i'm gonna tell y'all the certain parts that i tried to emphasize and this thing boy is 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 tight it's tight I, I i couldn't do no better than what i did i mean if y'all find somebody did better please send it my way i want to see it because i'm trying to figure something out man uh but yeah man another point guard man another hall of famer you know what i'm saying whether you like him or not i'm not a big fan of him but i do got a lot of respect for him the new Mr. Triple Double, that's right, Westbrook, Russell Westbrook, a.k.a. Brody. So we're going to do the Russell Westbrook replica build, the Brody build right here. That's right. So pick the name you choose. We're going to choose the position point guard. He is right-handed, so we're going to right hand. And his number is zero as well as my number. That's the one thing we share also with Dame Lillard and Gilbert Arenas, but that's neither here nor there anyway. You know, Russell Westbrook is 6'3", 200 pounds, 6'8", wingspan, and choose whatever body shape you choose. I'm going with the fine because I'm in the gym. I don't care if it's him or not. We both in the gym. You try to define too. I guess you can say that. It don't really matter. I'm the fine. That's all that matter. Anyway, now we're going to go into... <sighs> I'm, I'm going to emphasize. I'm going to let y'all know as we go what parts I really tried to, like bring up and it was just a struggle so close shot 76 driving layup is a 90 which is really good and driving ducks at 86 i tried to get that higher i wanted to get it up to a 93 i could not get it up to 93 <laughs> um you wanna go post control 69 uh i wanted to get that lower it wouldn't let me go lower <laughs> I, I could not get any combination that included it being lower couldn't get that either i tried a couple getting it higher but you really don't want to hire uh I, I really couldn't do anything but this that gives you 23 finish badges that's not bad at all uh, shooting mid range 76 I tried to get that up higher did not work I tried to get 3 point up to 80 that did not work so you go with 79 uh, free throw I tried to do that lower and just try some combinations lower none of the combinations matter I, I don't know whether it's the free throw itself I don't think the free throw itself matter it's just the combinations itself I could, I tried to get it didn't matter but I tried to get a, at least an 83 ball and I tried to get a little bit of a lower I mean a little bit of a higher mid range but I even tried to take it down one to put something else up and it won't let me do that either so 76 apparently is the exact number in 79 is the number I, it, I don't know you might be able to get the 79 lower but i definitely know you can't go higher uh and you get 18 shooting badges which ain't bad either that's actually not not bad at all actually 79 is not bad i just wanted to get up to 80 for the sake of uh pass accuracy 79 i try to get that up to 80 that didn't work either <laughs> paul handle 87 which is a good spot uh 87 gets you the uh gold clamp breaker so i like that one Speed with ball is 90, which is pretty darn good and very acceptable for uh, Russell Westbrook. And they get you 25 playmaking badges. Then interior defense, 34. Perimeter defense, 75. Could not get that higher. I tried to at least just go 76, so that way I can get uh, a gold uh, workhorse. Couldn't do that. Uh, I tried to get a still up higher. Didn't work. I even tried to go one. I just tried to go up to 64, and it didn't work. That would get you bronze glove. Right now, you don't get a glove at all. I try to get at least a bronze glove at 64. Couldn't do that. So, 39 block, 54 on the offensive rebound. And this man has an incredible, incredible defensive rebound for a point guard at 82. So, you're going to be grabbing boards. Even at, you know, 6'3", you're grabbing boards. So, that's pretty dope. But you only get 11 defensive badges. So, I don't think it's enough to call yourself a... a you're not a defensive liability. So, that's a plus. You're not a defensive liability. But uh, I wouldn't place you on the main ball handler. Going down to the physicals, speed 90. I could not even take that down. Uh, acceleration 88. Well, let me take it down. 
but you get strength at a 74, which means you get bronze bully. So that's not bad at all. And of course, you, I mean, you really can't, the next tier would be 82, but you don't even get up to 82. So, but 74 is pretty good. So you get that bronze bully. Uh, vert 84. Now, this is the thing that I tried the most. So my biggest spots I tried to get up was the shooting. That didn't work. And I wanted to get the defense up. That didn't work. So if I was able to get that offensive rebound to a 58, I could have got 12 defensive badges, but it wouldn't let me. Then I tried a combination where I tried to get the vert up to 85 because at 85, you get small contact dunks. But I had to settle for 84. And then I even tried going lower to boost some other stuff. It wouldn't let me. Because I'm like, if I can't get 85, I might as well go down to 82. Because you get the pro contact dunks, but you don't get the small contact dunks because that's at 85. So this is a very, very weird build very particular this is probably the most particular replica i've dealt with so far uh it was a challenge shout out to uncle demi who came out with the he has the same exact build and it's crazy that i could not <laughs> i came up with the same exact thing that he did uh without even knowing exactly i saw that he did it i didn't see exactly what he did and then i looked at it afterwards i was trying to see who came up with what it seems like everybody has the same thing and this is the best version of it that you can come up with so shout out to uncle demi i'm not gonna take full credit for this uncle demi came out with it first uh so shout out to uncle demi who i'm also a fan of so i don't feel bad by saying that but yeah but this is actually a pretty decent build though you know what i'm saying these are the takes you get uh you get some pretty good offensive takes you still get the shooting takes uh you just don't have the like one thing one of us is like uh i feel like it's missing a shooting one but Nonetheless, uh, you just don't get the lock takes. So, I chose the ankle breaking shots and the finishing moves. Um, but you can choose whatever you choose. You know that, that that part won't affect the build itself, as far as you know the build name. So choose whatever makes you feel good. You know what I'm saying fit your style. But there's some pretty good company there: Byron Davis, Jamal Murray, and and De'Aaron Fox. And you get Brody. Uh, this is actually a pretty nice build. Michael Ladia. Let's go into the to the baddest man. Now, normally, I, most of the time, I try to run through the badges myself and, and see what I come up with. But this is the first time I'm going through this. I spent so much time trying to figure this build out. <laughs> I just said, forget it, man. Let's just do the video. It's the best I could do. <laughs> so, uh, I definitely go feel this finisher all the way up on gold. Acrobat on gold. We're going to go uh, bronze on the bully. Of course, you got to go silver on the... Um, on the uh posterizer and we're gonna core that and then we're gonna come over here and you can go actually might as well go all the way up with it you ain't got nowhere else to go and we can get some put back dunks the area wizard or you know maybe you can even i don't go area wizard but you can go uh giant slayer as well you know what i'm saying uh i like that as a matter of fact you really only need this on silver so you could do this you know what i'm saying that works too I uh, wish we can get this. Uh, that will work out even good too. But if you got your plus four badges, uh, you got your plus four badges. You got these two here. Put them here, and you got six. You can get this on silver. So you know. But for real, for real, seeing as you got bully, <laughs> I wouldn't even bother putting on silly finish, silly finisher. Like you know, what I'm saying I feel like people keep talking. Uh, I've been hearing some YouTubers saying that bully is underrated. Psh, hey. If I can't get past you, I'm going to go through you. And it has worked out for me. So I don't know what they talk about. <laughs> but all right, I said we go silver, which is purpose by according to 2K Labs. That is uh, the hot, the, 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 what they call it, the good spot for, uh, you know, <laughs> the badge, whatever. But uh, Claymore, I'll throw that all the way up. Since you ain't a high level shooter, I'll throw that up. I'll throw a volume shooter so you get better as you shoot. Um, we ain't really trying to do none of these. Uh, might be able to do Dead Eye. Um, yeah, so you core Dead Eye. That'll get you good on the closeouts. Um, Mini Magician. I'll do bronze. Uh, 
yeah that'll work that looks pretty good actually that's not bad this is a pretty good pretty good lineup of badges all right move oh, make sure i got to that yep all right going to playmaking my favorite spot you know me my favorite this is my favorite category here you are the point guard so he ain't no big passer apparently uh they got that man at 70 79 you know i'm not necessarily disagreeing with it to be honest with you either um go bronze here bronze here bronze here um wait i did too much too soon go here i'm gonna core that and then we'll go back bronze here and throw that here then bow actually do not sleep on needle threader people have been hating playing with my point guard build because i have needle threader hall of fame do not sleep on this badge this year needle threader is worth it i promise you because dude kept trying to figure out why he could not intercept my pass like i'm going for the steal because i am stunning him every time i pass the ball this year needle threader will stun you so definitely worth it uh definitely go silver on on that right there uh Little workhorse like that. we don't have a lot so uh actually we don't you know i don't really feel the need to mm, what else we going with uh what else i got maybe i will do that and then come here that's not bad it's not bad at all uh we got 11 you do your plus four do your plus four badges here uh your plus four will put you at 15 and you can get something down here on bronze which i would definitely go for clamp so when you get your plus four badges i will put them on defense that will give you 15 uh defensive badges and that will be a good number because then you can get clamp on bronze and then you will be good you'll be copacetic that is fine that will, that's, that's perfect damn near you know what i'm saying so but till you do we're more likely to get it before you actually do this to be honest with you so we'll do that put this back in silver put that on set you all the off ball player now let's go ahead and do that um you ain't gonna be you ain't gonna be sending nobody so you ain't really don't even worry about that you're not you're not, you're not grabbing boards bro trust me <laughs> i mean you're not uh uh chasing down with 39 block you're you're not chasing nothing down god trust me you're not unfortunately if you want to you can go ahead and do it though you know what i'm saying you got one extra badge why not but it ain't gonna work it, it there's just way they do things which is kind of crazy to me but that's the lineup y'all like i said if i when you get your plus four badges i would definitely put them here on defense and go for clamp and then i would core clamp actually because you would get way more badges back and you know what i'm saying throw a lot of these badges on even if you don't need them hey you might be cut, caught in a situation where you might see that thing pop up and, and it saved the game. You never know. But I'd rather have it and not need it than need it and not have it. So, appreciate y'all for coming through. Uh, shout out to Uncle Willie for requesting me to do this, man. This was a challenge. It's actually kind of fun. You know what I'm saying? I like the challenge. So, if y'all want me to try to uh, work on any type of build, man, let me know. Hit me up in the comments. You know what I'm saying? Uh, let me know what, what you want me to work on, what you want me to try. So, appreciate y'all for coming through. Shout out to all my OGs, OHG, O-Head Gang. Shout out to my IQ Ballers and the Clamp Camp. Westbrook's not part of Clamp Camp in this build, but New Laker Westbrook, that man is playing some pretty darn good defense. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to him. But y'all know the model, man. Don't be toxic. And let's bowl. Never mind who you thought I was.